Good afternoon, everybody. It's Josh here from Looking for Games. It is Friday, September 17th, 2021. It is the weekend of pop-up Gen Con, as well as a pre-release weekend for Magic the Gathering. So we've got a lot going on this week. Let's jump right into things. As I mentioned, we've got our pre-release weekend kicking off tonight at seven o'clock. Uh, those sessions are completely sold out. We do have some sessions or spots, I should say, available for tomorrow's session, uh, also starting at seven o'clock. And you can still, it is still not too late if you want to get in on tomorrow's games um, to sign up at lookingforgames.com through our web store, or you can come in store and purchase them uh, tonight for tomorrow's event. Of course, as we have been talking about for quite some time now, pop-up Gen Con right around the corner starts tomorrow, kicking off at 11 o'clock. We're going to have games available of all kinds. We've got easily uh, six or seven different titles that are going to be uh, presented as well as some Q&A panels from a lot of great different sources. And uh, of course, I'll show you those again, uh, that list when we get a little bit later into the update. But we're very excited to uh, to have you all come in and uh, check us out. Some of some of you for the first time and some of you have been here before. Um, so, again, very excited. This is going to be a, a very cool and unique event. Kicking off on Sunday, of course, our next slate of looking for adventure. Uh, you can always sign up for those adventures at warhorn.net. DM Jeff and DM Jackie with their uh, introductory uh, one shot adventures and then uh, DM John on Thursday with an argument of interplanetary against interplanetary travel uh, continues on. For game night this week, we are introducing Game Week Games, brand new title uh, in their shuffling horror series, Innsmouth 32. Uh, gangsters on the Lamb have kidnapped a school bus full of children and have headed off into the haunted town of Innsmouth. And uh, of course, nothing good can come of that. This is a game for three to 13 players. And it's really cool because it actually has like a storytelling element uh, built into it. So you can create your own adventure as you go along. Again, this is the third in the Shuffling Horror series from Gamewick Games. Was very excited to uh, have Larry from, uh, from Gamewick reach out to us. Uh, about carrying this title. This is one that I saw a couple of years ago uh, at uh, PAX Unplugged, speaking of cons. So Innsmouth 32 is our game of the week. And of course, if that spot is full, if somehow we manage to fill up all 13 spots, <laughs> uh, if that game is full or if people are, are not interested in that title, we will also have uh, this previous week's game, Moonrakers, uh, available to play. So those two at tables one and two for game night. New in stock this week, the next addition to Marvel's cha Marvel Champions, the Nebula Nebula character pack comes out uh, with new technique upgrades and a pre-constructed justice deck, this sometimes friend and or enemy of the Guardians of Galaxy or frenemy of the Guardians of Galaxy is a force to be reckoned with. Uh, you can use her 15 signature cards and some powerful combos to bring enemies to their knees. So those of you that are trying to take on the collector just added a new weapon to your arsenal. Also new in stock for Warhammer Age of Sigmar, reinforcements have arrived for the Stormcast Eternals as well as the Auric War Clans in the form of new Storm Strike Chariots and Knight Judicators for the Stormcast and uh, Break a Boss and Beast Skewer Killbows for the Auric War Clans. Uh, along with those, we also have the new Battle Tomes, the new War Scroll cards, and the dice. And those are all available in stock starting tomorrow. Also from Games Workshop for Blood Bowl, we have the new Dark Elf Team card pack, as well as the Pitch and Dice, um, excuse me, Pitch and Dugout set, and as well as the new dice. And again, those are all available for pickup starting tomorrow. I did mention Innsmouth 32. We also have that in stock for purchase, as well as the other two games in the Shuffling Horror series from Game Wake Games, Pittsburgh 68 and Roswell 51. 
uh, as you can see, these are great uh, homage to some classic movie horror uh, genres or themes. So going to be uh, probably breaking those out of the box and getting those to the table as well. Pittsburgh 68, Roswell 51, and Innsmouth 32 are all available in stock. And we also have some great bundle pricing available uh, if you want to buy more than one of any of those titles. And those are in stock available starting today. In the queue this week, of course, that's our segment of upcoming events and titles. Pop up Gen Con. <laughs> yes, we've been talking about it. Yes, I'm sure you're all tired of hearing me say it, but here's the uh, a quick list of some of the games that we're going to have from Renegade Game Studios. We've got Gravwell, second edition, from Ravensburger, the Taco Bell Party Pack, from Slugfest Games, Dungeon Decorators, from Steamforge, the God Tier Games. We've got two different starter sets from the God Tier Games. Uh, from USAopoly, Mickey and Friends Food Fight, and from Weird, Bayou Bash. Um, added at the last moment was also a, a, a great title called... Um, <laughs> I just lost it. <laughs> okay, well, I guess you'll have to be surprised when you all come in. Uh, but there is one more title that was added to this, and I don't have it in my brain now. <laughs> We're just going to move on. Uh, of course, I also told you about the panels that are coming up, expanding the third dimension with McMaster 3D. Uh, you did that with Paint from Two Raven Studios, D&D &D for the rest of us from DN John, DM Johnny, uh, out of your head and onto the game table from One Day West Games, as well as Pentry Games. So those are four different panels that are all taking place uh, in the afternoon as well. And again, a big thank you to those of you that volunteered. Of course, you'll get this snazzy new looking for games pop up Gen Con t-shirt to wear around and impress your friends. <laughs> Finally, in the queue, coming in October, we uh, we ran a little bit of a sneak peek of this last weekend, uh, a narrative campaign called Defend Magic. We're going to have three different sessions. Uh, you'll be using uh, trying to capture objectives or uh, engage in a massive 22 threat battle. Uh, you're going to need all of your powers and skill to be able to defend magic. And that's going to be a three session narrative campaign starting in October. Finally, a couple of titles that are coming up, including Carcassonne, 20th Anniversary, Unfathomable, Machi Koro 2, My Hero Academia, Dinosaur World and Dinosaur Island Rar and Right. And also we've got two games coming in very soon from Pandasaurus. Uh, the Loop and Wild Space. So those titles and more are going to be coming very soon. That is the update for this week. Of course, if you like us, please like and subscribe. Feel free to tell others because as I always say, you should not be the only ones to suffer. Thank you for joining us and have a great weekend. We will see you here at Pop-Up Gen Con. Bye, y'all.